Unless Ruben Hurricane Carter was fighting Richard Iohitu, a.k.a. Dick Tiger. He'd only lose if he was drunk or robbed. I see boxing fanatics put up the debate all the time. Was Ruben Hurricane Carter overrated? My answer will always be no. Here's why. Ruben never ducked anybody in his division. He fought everybody he could. And Henry Hank was even offered a fight with Rube, but declined that offer with the excuse that he outweighed Carter too much to fight him. Having a record of 27 wins and 12 losses doesn't mean a thing. Unless the era you are fighting in is a dangerous one. Ruben's middleweight peers were tremendously skilled boxers, and his resume is great for a contender. Now, to take a look at this fight between that was a split decision loss for Carter. J this is just one of the losses on his record. The post-fight interview that he had, he would exclaim that he was never hurt by Joey Archer. It was an upset. And I made a video on this a while back about Joe Louis Adair, who knocked down and beat up Ruben Carter in the sparring session they had. At the time, I didn't even know that Ruben was actually intoxicated and drunk when that happened. To put things short and to keep things short, Ruben Hurricane Carter was truly a great fighter.